Hello guys, and welcome back to another Bucket Plugin tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Chat Component API from Spigot. The only requirement is that you are using the Spigot jar and not the Craft Bucket jar as your dependency. So I'm going to have a command here that's going to override the default help command actually, and we're going to send them a different message. Instead of whatever kind of help they were looking for, we're going to send them something else. We need to make sure the sender is a player, obviously, for this command. And then we can go ahead and create a text component. Make sure to import it from net.md5.bungie.api.chat. And we can name this message. And then we're going to create a new text component. And then here we can put the message that's going to be sent to the player. We're going to say, you need help. And then we're also going to change the font of this message. I will have the possible fonts on screen. There are only three currently. This was introduced in 1.16, so make sure your API's version is above that. So we're going to set the font. The only really usable one besides the default is the one called uniform. And you reference this by doing Minecraft colon uniform. The next thing we're going to do is set the hover event and we're going to create a new hover event and in here we the first parameter is going to be hover event dot action dot and there's a few things you can do here. You can do show text, show item, or show entity. Show entity and show item require a lot of code to convert entities to a base component. So I'm only going to be using show text in this episode. And then the second thing we're going to put in here is a new text from Spigot once again. And this is going to be whatever the text is going to be whenever we hover over this text. So I'm just going to say click me. And then since we put click me, we can go ahead and set what happens whenever we get whenever the message gets clicked now we can go ahead and create a new click event similar to what we did up above and continuing on that we can do click event dot action dot get a whole bunch of things here we are going to be using suggest command because I want to send them a message that's just going to be in their text box and I'm going to say you're not getting any help there we go and then we can go ahead and send this player the message but in order to do that you have to do player dot spigot dot send message not player dot send message you have to use a spigot api to actually send the message and we can go ahead and send our text component in right here and that is all we have to do i'll show you guys what this looks like Alright, so you can see here if I type in slash help, we don't get the normal message, we get the text, you need help in this weird looking font, and then if we hover over it, it says click me, and if we click on it, it says you're not getting any help. That's all for today, if this helped you out, make sure you leave a like, if you need any help, join the Discord, and that's all for today, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Nice, the mutt's nuts, in fact.